Let's Go, Ha Equa by Julie Flett. Julie Flett is one of my famous, one of my favorite illustrators slash authors. Um, she illustrated a poster for Read Your World, uh, which is formerly known as Multicultural Children's Book Day. And yeah, I just, I just love her illustration style. Um, and here, the book looks like it's bilingual. Um, I'm not sure the language. I think this might be Greystone Press. Oh, Greystone Kids. Um, so it is, she is Cree Metis. So I don't know if the language is Cree, but it looks like a, a contemporary story of Native American kids. Um, and it just looks like, you know, indigenous joy. So here he gets up, he gets ready. He's going to go skateboarding. Um, this is what he does after school. Oh, but now it's raining, so he can't go skateboarding. But look, he has these pancakes and soon he's got friends joining him and they are having fun skateboarding and it looks like it's a skateboard park and here they go and now there's a new kid and it's a girl um and it's an inclusive skateboard park and this is just the story about the skateboard community that it looks like she and her son were part of. That's so cool. I mean, like, now you see uh, kids skateboarding all over the world. Like, I see these YouTube videos of, like, very young children, like, in Asia and other countries who are, like, extremely good at skateboarding. Like, literally future Olympic um, skateboarders. And, in fact, skateboarding... Um, like where I grew up in Southern California in Seal Beach near Huntington Beach, you know, kids were skateboarding when I was a child. So that was like 40 years ago. And those kids who are really more my sister's age, like four years younger, they went on to be some of the first um, X game competitors. Like it literally started near my hometown with kids from my high school. And so the whole sport of skateboarding, which was kind of tied to surfing back then too, because it, it's like similar balance and um, I guess, you know, like you could do it if you weren't actually surfing. Um, but it's evolved into like a completely, you know, competitive sport. Um, I don't know if it's Olymp an Olympic sport, if it's more like X, like X Games, but like, um, but I mean, like you can have a serious career if you are very, very, very good at skateboarding. And there's, I think, all kinds of different types of skateboarding events. Um, kind of like, um, like there's different snowboarding events. And so it's kind of really cool to see how skateboarding has evolved um, and taken off all over the world, you know? And so here in an in indigenous community, you know, they have a skateboard park and they're super into it and I'm sure that, from this community, you're gonna have a superstar. Um, but, you know, she captures the motion so beautifully with her illustrations. Like, that's maybe one of my favorite spreads. And the joy, just the joy of, you know, like learning a skill, hanging out with your friends, um, and just, you know, learning, just learning how to do tricks. So thank you so much to Greystone Kids for sending me Julie's newest book. And thank you for watching.